So welcome, we are in uh, Campinas still and uh, there is a little market going on close to the home of my uh, Couchsurf hosts. Uh -huh. We're walking the dog. The dog is just uh, incredibly cute. He has this blonde hair and everything <laughs> and this uh, adorable uh, eyes. So uh, maybe I can show you guys. If I walk in front of it, I, I can... Pop. Say hi, <laughs> It's cute, no? And uh, yeah, it's it's nice because uh, it's code red. So uh, we thought there would be no market at all, but they still do this little uh, this little market, you know, Sunday market. Uh huh. Oh, every Sunday. Yeah. It's nice. They have some street food. This is pastel, the same that we ate yesterday in the municipal market. Maybe we can get some uh, some street food. Maybe yeah, we can try. Do like do like corn. They they ever they have everything made from corn. Everything made food. from corn. Yeah, yeah, corn and all the products something possible. We can go there to check. Uh, the Let's check it out. Way. There's pamoya, mingau, curau. Uh -huh. It depends uh -huh. on the decoration. And what is this? This is a uh, Japanese food. Japanese food. Japanese food. There's many many Japanese people in Campinas. Um, I think so. Yeah, it, it's so it's like Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo, Sao Paulo also has yeah, much more. A lot of Japanese yeah. people. This is a beer. So they, this is they, like a bar. Yeah. In a in a bus. Bar. Yeah, kind of, yeah. kind of. In which you can drink in right in open area. I like beer. it. I like yeah, it. Yeah. I like to drink the IPA. IPA. The, the, it's a kind of beer, Indian pale ale. Yeah. Very good. So in Brazil, the bars are uh, are closed, or at least in uh, Sao Paulo state, the bars are not allowed to be open. But they found the perfect solution for it, an open air bar right here at the, the little market, and uh, they have a bus with uh, the beer taps. It looks nice, eh? Wow, it's very cool. Ah, yeah, the beer. I like it. Yeah good now next uh, next door they have uh, a place where uh, everything is made of corn oh no that's that one this one is just a fruit juice place would you like to have some sugar cane it's like a juice the sugar cane yeah it's, a, it's nice no, she, it, she said that it's, it's not cold she doesn't have ice oh. No, it's okay. Would you like to taste a little bit? Taste a little bit? Yeah, she's gonna give us what? a taste. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> obrigado, obrigado. Ah. Taste it, sugar cane. This is so friendly, really. <laughs> obrigado, obrigado. Depois eu passo o link que vocês viram lá, que ele vai gravar. YouTube dele é todo Oh, nice. Fresh. Fresh? Isn't yeah, what, what is inside? Only sugar yeah, cane? Only sugar. Oh, she's gonna get one more time. Well, it's uh, it's seriously there. pretty good, uh, this Look stuff. That, uh, the this is the way. They have that machine. Oh there, my god. Or, I don't know how to say. They put over there and then they get. So why are you... Why are you this is that. <laughs> but they, they have made a lot of sugarcane juice this yeah, morning. For no? example, they get this one and they put through this machine. This uh -huh. uh -huh. like, right, or something like that. And then this is the outcome. It's delicious, really. <laughs> and I, they're very popular because uh, look at all the sugar cane juice they made this morning. It's completely full. I cannot believe this. And uh, my Couchsurf host, they're very kind. They helped me promote my YouTube channel in uh, Campinas. I think I will become a, a Campinas uh, YouTuber, so settle down here. Thank you, thank you. Obrigado, obrigado. No, they are, they are staying here to talk to them. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, they want to say. Nice, nice, nice. They work here. <laughs> so Brazilian people, they are very friendly. I, I really, since, since day one, I feel uh, very comfortable in this country. And uh, I didn't expect anything when I went here, but uh, now I love it, seriously. Now, next door they also have a, a little uh, shop which sells everything made from uh, corn. So uh, I guess corn yogurt, corn, everything. I will put on my mask uh, because uh, I'm gonna get closer to the corn. Look at all the corn stuff. Corn bread in the shape of a corn. Wow. 
It's good, yeah. Yeah, every everything here is made of uh, of corn, right? Yeah. Is this is corn cake? Yeah, 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 yeah. So if you like corn, then you have to come here because uh, this is corn heaven. Now, sadly, they're closing down part of the market already because uh, this morning we were being a bit lazy, but we're gonna get some Japanese food. I already talked with the man. I'm allowed to film in the kitchen so I can show you guys how the Brazilian people make Japanese food. It's gonna be awesome. Okay, so, uh, so, Douglas, he just told me that every market has uh, two things, pastel and sugarcane juice. Yeah. That, yeah, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> that's, uh, that's the typical market snack. So, uh, if you're on a market in Brazil and you don't know what to, uh, what to uh, order, what to eat, then you can get that. Here's the pastel and uh, there's the sugarcane. Look at these cars, they're very nice, right? Yeah, combi. These, uh, very common in Brazil. Old Though style. it's not used anymore, but it's very common. I like it. Yeah, yeah. Fusca and combi. You, Beetle. You see these, you see these, uh, these little cars a lot, and uh, I really like them. You see them everywhere in Brazil, but in my country they are rare. And, uh, it's like stepping back in time, 30 years. Now, let's order the... What did you say was very good here? The, what is very good here? Ah, yakisoba. 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 What, which one is it? This one. This one. This bowl. Yeah. It's nice. very well served. Okay, it's let's good. let's order uh -huh. the yakisoba. Ah, okay. okay. He doesn't have shrimp inside. Okay. Oh, that's okay. Okay. That's okay. okay. Is is this all the flavors? The yeah. flavors. Uh, Chicken, carne, meat, uh -huh. shrimp, mix, yeah. uh, uh, meat and and chicken. And Mistone, big mix, in, including the three other dough. For me, the, yeah. chicken sounds very good. Chicken? Chicken is very chicken good, Chicken yeah. with them. Bravo. What's it? Nice. Ah. The, the, the small one, pequeño. Huh? Would you like to see over there? Yes, can I go in? Can you see? Can you show it? Which one? Ah. These or this? A little one, you, yes. Yeah, you, want to, one? you want to share? You no, want to eat? I don't want to eat. No? eat the ah. little dough. Then for me, the small yeah. one is okay. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Can you see? Can you see? Go there? Yeah, he said you can, you can go. That's yeah. so great. I'm going into the kitchen. I'm going to give you guys uh, a, a look into the kitchen of a Japanese food stand right here. It's very nice. Eh? There's the frying pan. Uh -huh, uh -huh. It's, 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 yeah, it is, uh, the oil will uh, will jump, right? So we gotta be careful here a little bit. It's very interesting because I'm standing on top of a little uh, yeah, little stairs and, and they can they can flip the stairs flip, inside yeah, like flip. that. Yeah. yeah, they flip. Pretty cool. Now, I'm so glad we found this market. You know, they're they're about to uh, to close to finish. Most of them. Mm -hmm. Yesterday we went to the other place and uh -huh. they were closed. But I know. Yeah. Good thing is open. Yes. We got one Campinas market in the vlog. Yesterday we also tried to uh, visit another market, but uh, it was closed, which means there were no stands at all because uh, because it's code red here, as I said, so uh, not much is uh, allowed. But right here we found a little market.
We can take a quick look at the food. Oh wow! It looks very good. Chopsticks is good, yeah. Perfect. So uh, there's a lot of sauce on top of this dish. I'm gonna try it out, I'm very excited. And it's a lot of food. It's uh, The price is just 18, uh, 18 reales, right? 18 reales. 18 reales, that's like 3 euros. But you get a lot of food for 3 euros in Brazil. Where is uh, Jonathan? He's buying a beer. No way, he's buying beer? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta have this on the shot. Yeah, Jonathan is, uh, is drinking beer on a Sunday morning. Oh, that's what I, I know, yeah, yeah. I'm buying this one. You're buying beer? Yeah. It's so cool, eh? Yeah, it's sad, this one. Yeah, I just bought. I know, it, it's so cool they have the, the tap. Ipa. Ipa, Indian pale ale. It's very tasty. I like these kind of buses. They have a uh, built in tap. Is it good? Yeah. Taste it. Thank you so much. It's very uh, stronger than the other beers that we have. Very strong, yeah. Uh -huh. This is uh, Ipa. He it says it's a very strong beer. The taste is bitter. Remember that I said it's a little bit bitter, but it's okay. Oh, nice. No, but very nice. Like, like a little it. bit fruity, it's right? Yes, oh, yeah. No, no. no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, thank you, thank you. <laughs> so kind, eh? Uh -huh. You see, in Brazil, camera people everywhere. It's great, you don't need to bring a team. I, I got your beer, I got your beer. No, I forgot. No, you can hold it. No, no, I gotta, I gotta go back to the Japanese food. And uh, I was try the Japanese to see food. him tapping, but uh, you yeah. were there, I didn't want to. If he taps another time, I will run here okay. and I will uh, film it. All right. Enjoy. Okay. So uh, now we're gonna try the Japanese food. I'm running all over this market because uh, of course, I want to show you guys as much as possible. Oh, it's takeaway, yeah. Let me try, uh, let me open it up here and then... Are, are we allowed to eat it here? It's 23. Ah, 23, yeah? Yeah. Okay, let me pay and then... I would have one, uh, one to try. Let's open it up and see if it's, uh, if it's any good. Are we allowed to eat here? Yeah. Yeah. Just for one. He puts a hashi here if you like. Oh my god, he, he wrapped it up pretty hard. <laughs> Don't worry, I will cut this out. Yeah, wrap it. Yeah. Like break it, right? Yeah. It's better. Of course, we're gonna eat it with chopsticks. Okay. The right way to eat uh, Japanese food. Look at this, guys. Okay. It's a lot of food. Yeah, for a little bit of food. For 23, so that's like 4 euros. A lot of chicken, big pieces of chicken. We're gonna try that first. Good. Yeah. Wow. It's uh, much good. Wow, what's up? Yeah, bon. mm. Delicious, really. You want? No? Mm. Okay. This is enough food for three people, I think. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna work on it. Maybe I'm gonna take it home and then. Yeah. 
So uh, there is some, some vegetables inside, and then you got the very thick Japanese style noodles. Let's give that a try. It's not like a normal uh, normal Asian noodles. Japanese noodles they tend to be a bit thicker. I learned this many years ago when I was in China. I had Japanese food there for the first time, one of the first times, and I completely fell in love with it. I'm making a mess, but it's very delicious. Mm -hmm. The noodles are very chewy. The rest of the food I'm gonna take home because uh, this is a lot. It tastes much like the Chinese food in my country. We uh, we call it Chinese food, but it's like Indonesian Chinese food, and you can get that anywhere in any town in my country in the, the Netherlands. And uh, it tastes much like this, really. Okay. Now, I think the whole market is uh, closing and it's going to rain soon. So I'm going to I'm going to check out. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Thank you for watching. Stay safe, stay awesome. See you in the next one. Ciao ciao. That's pretty decent. Yeah, very difficult to do. <laughs> it's an extra day for an idea. Oh my god.